guys. So, keeping up with um, the theme for this week, we're going to do a nice upper body workout. Today's workout is going to be a Tabata workout. So you're going to set your timers for 10 seconds of rest, 20 seconds of work, uh, for 16 rounds. So we're going to do four different exercises, four times through. Remember, these Tabata workouts are super short, so make sure that you're pushing as hard as you can during your 20 seconds of work so that you get everything you can out of this workout. All right? So, first exercise is mountain climbers. For those of you guys just starting out, you're going to start in a plank position. You're going to step your left foot forward and bring your knee on the outside of your body. You're going to touch with your foot, and then you're going to bring your foot back. Then you're going to do the same thing on the right. Bring the foot back and just alternate. Touch, touch. Okay? Making sure that you're keeping your uh, core nice and tight. Your body line is straight. Next level up is you're going to touch in the middle, so in between your hands. So you're starting a plank position. Bring the foot up. Knee is in between your elbows. And then come back. Touch, come back. Touch, come back. The faster you do this motion, the more difficult it's going to be. Okay? And then finally, for those of you who want to do the regular version of the mountain climbers, it's the same motion except you're just not going to touch at the top, okay? So we're in our plank position, body is straight, core is tight, and we're just gonna bring our knee up. Okay, and then uh, the faster you go, the more difficult it becomes. Okay, so it should kind of look like you're doing um, high knees, but on the ground, all right? Second exercise is shoulder taps. So for this one, I'm gonna face the camera at first so that you can see. So for those of you guys starting out, you're gonna start with your uh, knees on the ground, okay? So we're gonna bend our knees and we're gonna hold a nice straight body line. And we're gonna take our right hand and touch our left shoulder. And we're gonna bring it back down. And we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Touch, touch. And we're just gonna alternate uh, touching our shoulder until we reach our 20 seconds of, uh, once our 20 seconds are over, okay? For those of you who want to do the regular version, you're gonna come up onto your feet and touch. And just alternate through your 20 seconds of work. Remember when you're doing this that you want to try and keep your body nice and still, okay? Try and keep your hips as still as possible. Try not to use your hips to bring your body up so that you can touch, all right? A little bit of movement is fine, but try and keep, as still, keep your hips as still as possible. That's also going to make it more difficult. Next exercise is called a bucking bronco. So, for those of you just starting out, we're going to do um, we're going to do the same modification. You can do the same modification that we did for the first exercise. So you're going to start in a plank position, and you're going to touch on the outside. Touch on the outside. Okay. If you think that's a little bit too easy, you can try doing ski abs. So. If you remember, we're going to start in a plank position. We're going to hop both feet towards our left elbow. Hop, and then back to the middle. And then other side, back to the middle. Okay? And you're just alternating. Okay? Here are your 20 seconds of work. <clears throat> a little technical difficulty here. Um, next level up is to do the bucking bronco. So, for this, you're going to start in your plank position. Go ahead and walk your feet over to one side, and you're just going to hop all the way over to the other side. So it's going to look like this. Try and bring your legs up as high as you can. All right? And you're just going to alternate. 
So, if you're doing it real time, it's going to look like this. All right, for your full 20 seconds of work. <clears throat> and finally, last exercise is going to be side planks. So, for those of you guys just starting out, you can do these on your knees. So you're going to start in a plank position. I want you to lift your right hand up towards the ceiling and then come back down. Then you're going to do the left side. Lift it up, come back down, and just alternate through your 20 seconds of work, okay? <clears throat> to make it a little bit more difficult, you're going to come up in the plank position and then lift. Stretch through, come back down. Other side, stretch through, come back down. Make sure you're looking up towards the ceiling when you do this. And that'll help to fully rotate your body back and forth. Okay? So those are your four exercises. Mountain climbers, uh, shoulder taps, bucking broncos, and then the side planks. So uh, make sure you really push again on this workout, and I promise you it'll be a good one.